Hello fellow rebels, welcome back to the channel and today's video I have not planned <laughs> so I just watched a Freddy Dobbs video said you know something I'm going for a spin so pocket on the boots now nowhere in particular to go um, I text young Dan um, maybe to get my t-shirt and um, stuff like that and meet up but um, I'll see if he texts me back if he doesn't I just need to go for a spin get out on Bonnie um, it's near the end of the year now, but you'll be seeing this video in 2024, which is now. Weird. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm gonna get out for a spin. The weather's been crazy the last couple of days. Like, wind goes up to 92 kilometers, which you know yourself is not great for anybody, never mind bikes. Um, there was a big tree fell on the taxi actually, as well. Um, the last couple of days from tomorrow which is Saturday. I know it's hard this time of the year, I know what day of the week it is. But tomorrow, Saturday, is supposed to be absolutely mental weather altogether. Um, it could be a hurricane, um, winds as well, speeds and all that kind of stuff. So it's calm today and it's lovely. A little bit wet, but that kind of adds to it. So it'll be a nice spin wherever we go. So join me on the spin and uh, I'm gonna get on the rest of my gear. to spin out and um, I'll create a couple of shorts on my channel so if you want to have a look at that just a recap on some of the places I went this year and then it's a monthly recap so a clip from every month of the year and um, flashing images as well a warning for that thanks Susan again and um, so yeah let's get on the bike I'm just about ready to go now and then um, we'll get the keys and out the gap we go here I forgot then that it doesn't have it done yet so I had to pull in and get fuel anyway and um, like it's a near perfect day for the time of year it is for the winter time you know um, 
what I was occupying my mind on the way out the road was, you know, how nice it was out, but at the same time, um, how kind of dangerous it can be as well with the sun through the trees flickering through your eyes and stuff like that. So like, it's really the simple things on bikes that are the biggest challenges I find anyway. And um, like, it's just a simple spin out the road, the simple joy of riding out the road. And um, they can be actually the best spins that you have, even if they're a half an hour, or an hour, or whatever. They seem to be much better. But yeah, it's, I think it's about six, seven degrees, I think. Seven degrees, which is still bad. Wind is kind of ripping up a small bit. But the winter, with winter riding, the joys are simple. Um, like it's really cold in the shade and stuff like that when you're going through you can feel it through like and I can't prepare and all that kind of stuff Carmel's <laughs> on as well but I can really feel it you know but when the sun comes out then the winter sun is so strong it's so warm and it just warms you up um, after the cold spells on the bike even though I have the heated grips on as well you would definitely need that so um, yeah it's just a simple joy to ride Quick positive shout out to the owner of the black car in front of me. They made a fantastic decision. I didn't see it until the last minute. When they pulled in, I was wondering why they were stopping and that's exactly why. So, great decision making. It helped me not make a decision or make a bad decision either by um, going with that car as well. So, for the longest time, all we do is look at the negatives on the road, but this is a massive positive. So, kudos to that um, black Jeep driver and um, well done, happy days. I was very happy at the time when I seen that car, the secondary car pass, and um, that's the difference between getting home safe and not getting home at all.